Well, hello, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's doing fine. I really do. Haven't been around for the last couple of days very much. Um, I still ain't around right now too much. I might have to go at any moment, so it might be short. Mm, might make a good video. Don't know. Uh, my better half just had back surgery and uh, she's hopefully going to do better. Was well, doing pretty bad. Hopefully it's going to be better now. Don't know. Just have to wait and see. I have seen this for the last few days now that they've been building this. Whatever it is, I can't it's not clear enough it's too far away to know what it is but it looks like the beginnings of rebar but it's awful tall but we got to take into consideration how deep that concrete is actually going to be it looks as if they're moving out all the heavy equipment um, now and this area right here is becoming damn Oh my god. I'm... But anyway, sorry. Puppy, pig, you name it. I got it going on. They're anxious. It's been raining for two weeks down here. They really high on the ball right now. Anyway, this little area that we were talking about right here, they've actually got a road going all the way down across. Another valley going down here. Up. Well, let's just. Man, ain't gonna let me do it. Goes up. I told you. <laughs> as soon as I get it fixed, I have to wait till it gets there. But they actually got a road that goes all the way. Two or three roads that go all the way across the dam now. <coughs> From them breaking breaking the system down and moving it the way the land structure the way they want to. And yet again, they're still working on this area right here. But as you notice, it's starting to get a little bit flatter up here and getting more uh, level, if you will. It's getting, you know, more level compared to what it was. Now maybe that's what they're doing. They're going to, you know, break it down into stairways. I can't answer that. Not fully. That's what it looks like they're doing, though. I'm going to stick with that. That's what it looks like. It would be nice if the camera had a little bit higher thing, but right here, right through here, it goes through. Now, we can't see the other one. Yeah, we can. It's right here. It goes up and through here. But that's a road now. That used to all be all different. It used to be a great big old hump right here. Well... You can't see it now, it's done gone. <laughs> but as you see, they have been making a big, big difference in the way the land is actually constructed. It don't even look the same anymore, folks. I mean, it's totally different compared to what it was at the beginning. I mean, I mean, it's different. It's way different. I don't know what how they're going to completely do this down through here yet but it you can tell that they're actually building roads in through here one here damn it a son of a bitch moves as soon as you get ready it moves they're doing the same thing everywhere they're making the line inlet roads and it's kind of strange they actually look like they've been doing some digging right through here Looks like they're either building another one or they digging that one out. I don't know which. I missed a couple of days, but it looks like they've been doing. They're definitely doing some more drilling. Looks like they got rid of that one mound there that was where the spillway had broken and they had that concrete in there. Looks like that's gone now. They have done a lot. And I mean a lot. 
It's like if you don't watch it every day. Now, yesterday I put up a video of nine hours of this running all day long yesterday and time lapsed it, you know, speed it up, sped it up. It was nine hours worth of stuff that I turned into about an hour. So it goes pretty fast, but you can actually see the landscape starting to change. When I can periodically, I'm going to do that. I just, you know, can't do it every minute of every day. So let's go look at some other stuff. Well, here you go, folks. A little bit of frequency rings going on. There's several in here. You can see them. They're not big tonight. But there is several of them in a bunch of different places. California. Well, we can just count them out. Some of them anyway. One, there's two here. One here. Here. One there. One here. One here. 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 Oh no, one here. There's a bunch of them around. There's about 14 total. A lot of severe weather here and there. Uh, especially around Florida right now. Getting more rain. Which, to be so dry to begin with this season, it's making up for it now. That's for sure. And over here, this is the uh, dashboard for none other than harp mm. I'm sorry CERN and they have got some serious stuff going on around here today and it's 6.5 TEV folks and they are showing their running except on still some maps they got turned off but you can see they got dots on the page now let's go down here to um, where is it? I'm looking for it hold on there it is this one and you can see the red and the green energy beam RF frequency beam 2 is in here and frequency 1 is not on this one but it is on this side but it's still supposed to be turned off folks oh yeah right And this one right here is kind of a new chart, although this one shows that it's not doing anything except for the laser sh shutter. But everything else seems to be sh seems to be shut off. And then we got this one, and you can see for yourself. And then this one, boy, it's getting down now, that's for sure. And over here on this one, you can see for yourself that all these up here are all lit up with something. Let's just see how many people are in here today. This one's showing three. That's so it's showing four. Oh, look at 
look at that. Hmm. And they are colliding particles. You can see them ricocheting in there. Boy, oh boy. Let's refresh this page so it looks like the second time. Ooh, look at there. Got some trying to escape. Boy. It's trying to escape. Just do it one more time here. Ooh, got some more trying to escape. And boy, look at that collision. And that's a collision right there. Let's let's just do something here. Let's let everybody get a good bullseye view of this. Zoom in on it. We might even want to go down to even way into here. Oh, change it again. Look at that. There you go. You see all the stuff where it's moving around. And it's just about time to change again. We'll see what the next one looks like. Oh, that one just completely petered out, didn't it? Wait for one more, see what the next one looks like. And there you go, then collided another one, another collision. Oh, it's kind of dark and heavy in spots. Then we can look at our little floor map thing they got going on here. Check it out one time, see what it does. Seventeen, fifteen more second, thirteen, twelve, eleven. Oh wow, there you go, big elements, well folks, like I said before, this machine can't be no good for nothing, that's just my opinion, nobody likes it, I don't care about that either, that's my opinion. And I don't believe that it's good for nothing because of the energy that it creates and the magnetic field that it creates on the earth. And any other thing that it may cause to cause different changes in the weather and modifications to the earth. But hey, people are going to believe what they want to believe no matter what. They're going to say and do whatever they want as well. We did get a few photos today. So let's go through them. This is one of them. There's another one. Looking up the crane. And I just do want to add this one thing to you, for you guys. This is a massive crane. And then there's some big old ass power guns right there too. That's some serious water coming out of them things. 
I bet them boys are some tired, tired, tired campers in the afternoon. And there you go, some more of the big rocks. Different levels. Guys, y'all got to know that, that that thing he's holding there is not light. Now, this is a little bit clear to this right here, but it's still not enough. Not close enough. Actually, get a good feel. Looks like it's got screen mesh and them things as tall as those guys I guess they're gonna make that concrete pretty deep five six foot deep I got that ought to hold up and now they got the spillway they got a road all the way across there now going to them other roads I mean, they, they've definitely done some serious work in the last two days. They're getting it. I ain't no joke about that. And it does look like they're going to stare wet. It may be just the way they doing it so they can fill it in. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see how it works out. Well, this shot's going to look a little different, but it's... It's mighty big, a real tall, long shot. And you can see the different levels they got in here. There's one there, one here, one there. They're about to finish this one through here. And they've actually done a lot. Changed the whole structure to the side of the mountain right here. Where the wall was at to come down through here. They're working on digging all that out as we speak right now. Still got that one little piece of wall right there that they hadn't taken down. And maybe that one little piece of decking there. I think that's as far as they're going to go is up to where they cut it. And then they're going to rebuild that down to here. Just have to wait and see what they're doing there. But folks, if you like my work and what I've done and what I've been bringing to y'all, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the gearbox. Hit the check mark, make the bell look like this, and my video should come to your feed from thereafter. So with that, from my cold dead hands, and I damn well mean it, abolish corporate government for your freedoms. Y'all have a wonderful day and a wonderful night. Speak to y'all soon.